how to upload your data to the NIH FigShare instance. As part of the NIH Strategic Plan for Data Science, the NIH is committed to making datasets from NIH investigator publications more accessible. NIH has launched the NIH FigShare instance, nih.figshare.com, a generalist repository platform for storing and reusing research data produced by NIH-funded researchers that comes with a few bonus features over the normal figshare.com. This video will demonstrate the process of creating an account on nih.figshare.com and uploading your data sets. To create an account, go to nih.figshare.com and click on the sign up link in the top right hand corner. From here, you'll be prompted to fill in a brief sign up form. Once you've created an account, you can log in to see your submissions in the top right and you'll find a link to submit a new submission. Once you've clicked submit, you'll be prompted to upload your data file or files. Simply browse your computer or drag and drop the files into the browser. There is also support for submission via the Figshare API if desired. More details regarding submission via the API will be provided on this later in the video. First, insert a title. For information on how to best complete the fields for maximum exposure of your data, see our how-to guide linked in the description. Tips on how to fill out each of these fields can also be found on the right-hand side of the screen. Select an item type from the drop-down menu. We accept any file type and preview over 1,200 file extensions in the browser. Add authors. Search by entering the email address or ORCID if the author has synced their ORCID to their Figshare account of the author you want to add. To add an author who doesn't have a Figshare account, select Add Author Details and enter their name, email address, which is optional, and ORCID, also optional. You can rearrange the order in which the authors appear and remove yourself as an author if you are uploading on behalf of someone else. Select a category. You can choose more than one and either select from the drop-down menu or search for your subject area. If you can't find exactly what you're looking for, we recommend finding the best option and getting more specific in the keywords section. Add keyword or keywords. These should be more specific than the category and help others find your research. Add as many keywords as you want, just hit enter after each keyword. Figshare remembers ones you've previously entered and will suggest keywords based on keywords that have been added to the database previously. Write a description. This should include any relevant information that pertains to your research. This includes information about the methodology, approval for the data collection, or legal or ethical requirements. Be as descriptive as you can. It's also worth noting that you can paste HTML into this field. You can also add funding information related to your data and references to other materials related to your research outputs. When typing in your funder information, Figshare will search from a database of grant information powered by dimensions for your funder and hyperlink to the dimensions page, bridging the connection between your research outputs and the funder. To add funding information that doesn't appear in dimensions, just type the funder information into the field and don't select anything from the drop-down menu. Select a license. This will determine how others can reuse your data. You can choose from a number of licenses based on your reuse requirements. And lastly, confirm that the data is de-identified to protect privacy and confidentiality. After these fields have been filled in, click Submit to send the data and metadata to a metadata quality check to be sure your information is accurate. The team may work with the submitter to make edits to ensure accuracy and greatest discoverability before making the data public. As part of this process, we will check that uploads match the description, files are provided in a format that can be shared, reused, and preserved, metadata sufficiently describes the data or links to resources that further describe it, and that embargoes are used appropriately. Once the submission has been approved and the data and metadata are publicly available, the item will be assigned a DOI and usage metrics, including views, downloads, citations, and alt metrics. These will all be tracked automatically. If you have large files or many files, you may find the desktop uploader application or the API application programming interface are more suitable. 
Links to both these tools and more information on them can be found in the description of this video. For more information on the NIH Figshare instance, please visit the links in this description.